In this scenario, we're going to see what happens when ETCD goes down. ETCD is a critical component in uh, Patroni. So let us simulate this scenario where ETCD goes down. To begin with, let's see what the primary node is. So as you can see, this is the leader or primary as of now. So let's go to the server. This is the primary server or the leader node. And as you can see, the read only is off on this server because it's primary. And then the create table succeeded. Now let's go ahead and uh, stop etcd. So you can see etcd is running successfully on this server. So I'm going to stop it. Service. In this case, we only have uh, one etcd instance, but in real time, it's good to have at least three. Since this is just a test environment, we only have one etcd instance. We stopped it. So as soon as we stopped it, let's run the Patroni CTL command. Now you can see that it is erroring out because uh, etcd is down. And let's go to the primary node and check the read-only status. As you can see now the read-only is turned on. Before it was off and now Patroni demoted it to be read-only. And we can validate that by trying to run this create table and this should fail. Now you can see that it failed with this error saying that you cannot run create table when it is replica. So as you can see etcd is very critical and if it is down your uh, Patroni cluster will be impacted and the leader is demoted and it became replica. So make sure you monitor the health of etcd cluster and keep it available all the time. In previous scenario, we have uh, brought down etcd and uh, it demoted the leader node to be replica. But there is a new feature called uh, DCS uh, failsafe mode. We can uh, enable that using a command like this. Failsafe mode equal to true. And then uh, the configuration was changed as you can see. Let's see how this uh, configuration change will impact. Let's see what the current leader is. Our current leader is this server, the same server where we are in. And let's log in. And as we can see, the read-only is off, which means this is a primary. Now we're going to stop etcd like before. Let's do status. etcd is active. We're going to stop. stop now and uh, as you can see stopped uh, let's see what happens so the read only state is still off and this command is running out like before because uh, the etcd is down 
but let's go back and check the read only status as you can see it did not demote in this case so when you use this uh, dcs fail so fail safe mode it is not demoting so that is one thing to note uh, there are like etcd issues sometimes maybe this mode will help you kindly check on this uh, configuration uh, variable and uh, you can use it uh, according to your use case So we have seen two scenarios for ETCD failure. The one without failsafe mode, what happened there is the leader demoted itself to replica. So we had a three node cluster, one leader and two replicas. And uh, when ETCD was down, all the three became replicas because the leader demoted itself to replica so that is a dangerous situation and uh, etcd health is very important as you can see normally when it cannot communicate to with uh, communicate with etcd there's a retry timeout and even after that if it cannot things like this things like this can happen but uh, sometimes fail safe mode can be beneficial so we have seen when the fail safe mode is enabled postgres continued to be leader did not demote itself to be replica like we have seen in this scenario so if it can access all the known members of the cluster via patroni rest api it will continue to be leader so in some cases it will be different but in this case it continued to be leader because it was able to communicate with the rest of the members in the cluster